what's going on everyone welcome back to another video all right yes sir this is my 2017 toyota tundra it is the limited edition crew max so the issue that i've been experiencing is with my front led turning signals now i had the halogen in here you know by default then i upgraded to led bulbs now with the halogen i had the same issue the ball burned out so i was like okay that's the perfect opportunity to upgrade to the led which you can see right there that's the led kind of zoom in a little bit so that one's out that one's working now watch as i adjust the bulb which is here you'll see you see how it turned on See how if I push some pressure on it, the light will come on. Oh, turn signal is not working. Prongs inside are damaged, but you can see on my uh, towing mirrors, it's 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 flickering, but here it's not. Commonly, I've experienced this issue on my driver's side. Passenger side, it did it once. Commonly, the driver's side has done it. Check the fuses, replace the fuses, it's not the fuse. I don't have anything additional that's gonna draw power from that bulb. I did a little research. I did a little research, guys. Whenever the socket burns out, it will burn each and every bulb that you install in here. So this is our replacement LED bulb. It's only uh, roughly, you know, $20. Previously had the high-end brand type of LED bulbs ranging from $50 to $100. They all blew. Even the stock OEM Toyota halogen bulb blew. Let's not go to the discussion that cost of a bulb is the result of our problem. It's not that, okay? But this is the ultimate... And I got two of them because I wasn't too sure exactly which one will actually arrive in time. So what we got here is our socket. So I got the actual OEM one. So you guys can rock out and see the part number there. As you can see, genuine Toyota socket plug. That's what she looks like. And then I have aftermarket show you this is the socket let's pretend this is a wire harness so we got a wire harness which connects to our socket which then we take our led bulb and plug it up to there that's basically how it works commonly whenever your halogen or led bulbs or whatever turn in bulbs that you have in there when they commonly burn up this is the culprit okay so this the terminals inside is going to basically overheat the pins on your bulbs so you see those pins there they're overheated that they become loose and thus failure i don't really have enough space to do so but i can oh my goodness i was trying to tell you guys i could take this bad boy out kind of show you what i was referring to so that socket it basically heats up these pins or connectors and they basically become fragile and they just break apart <clears throat> so that's the failure with the bulbs all right guys so here's the socket right here so as you can see the burnt marks represents that the socket has been overheating which is causing the pins to the led bulb or halogen bulbs to dissipate uh, or you can just say you know it is it, it it's causing the pins to break. We can always just go in here and just throw in another LED bulb, but we're gonna be back in the same position. We have to unclip it. So we just basically press down and pull that puppy out and uh, just, you know, install the new one. There we go. Pop that bad boy off. We'll take a look at that afterwards. 
I'm installing the new socket. So we got the wire harness and got the new socket. We just snap this bad boy in. <clears throat> yep, she's in there. All right, new socket. Now let me get this, uh, get the bulbs out. there all right as you guys can see that's working what we can do is put it through the socket so she goes right here I found the uh, spare bulb, so we're good to go. Now it will match. Daytime running, when it's turning, it's ambered. The socket is overheating, causing the actual bulbs, pins, to also overheat and thus disconnect the original stock one so again i'll try to uh do my best to leave a description of where i purchased them from which you know you guys should know is amazon but uh yeah problems off don't forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel if you're not a subscriber peace and love holla y'all